So the fight over black Santas and I guess the offensiveness that it brings has reached Steven Crowder and his crew on his show. Um, I mean, they're discussing whether or not this is real or whether or not, whether or not this should even be happening. Um, let's start there before they get to the racism. Disney, World Disneyland, they're, they're hiring uh, black Santas. Oh, good. And uh, before we get, Dave, have you ever, have you ever seen a black have you ever seen a black Santa? I can't guess if I'm in the wrong mall. You? Uh, figurines <laughs> at Dollar Tree. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> Here's the thing. I don't care. Okay, Coda Black Garrett. Yep. Did you want a black Santa? What about your full black relatives? Where they were like, no. I want a black Santa. If no. you had a black Santa show up, do you think you'd be like, oh, that's one of the, that must be one of his yeah. helpers from the the mall? I mean, that's obvious. All the ones in the mall, they're always the helpers. They're always helpers, the ones in the mall. Uh, quick thing on, on how funny it is to be racist. Um, it's only funny if you're talking to other racists. It's not even funny then, it's just, oh yeah, it's a, it's a signal. We're both pieces of garbage, right? Yeah, that's right. That's all that did. Um, the next part is even more of it. Let's listen to that. This is the most blatant wow. example of cultural <laughs> appropriation that I can think of. Wearing a sombrero, Taco Tuesday, that you brought, that you purchased yeah. from a Mexican is not cultural yeah. appropriation. No. Taking a historical figure who has been an important, arguably one of the most important cultural icons of Western civilization and changing the race is cultural appropriation. I don't care. I just don't know why it's necessary. I don't understand why you f why people feel they need a black Santa Claus. Yeah. He, he, he just can't figure it out. I mean, no one's ever told him. He's never read a book. He's never opened his eyes, never heard it from anyone ever. It's just it's just what is. You know what? Racism is based in ignorance. So yes, you're illustrating just what we uh, just what it means when you don't know what's going on around you in the world. Therefore, you just don't know. So you just hate those people and the folks that are going around in your world. Um, so also, at the beginning of that, he goes, it's not that I don't really care, I don't care that much. And he goes on for several <laughs> minutes about how much he cares about it because he's talking <laughs> about it for several minutes. Do you care or do you not care is the first question. And, and, and well, we'll get to the historical figures, I'll leave that to you. Yeah, so, <laughs> so look, uh, first video had a couple of hilarious moments. Uh, I'm not mad, I'm amused. Uh, so. I'm amused at the racism, sorry. Uh, so uh, he's like, have you ever seen a black Santa at the wrong mall? I don't even, what does that mean? Like you went to the wrong mall because what, there's, <laughs> a, is it a black mall? I don't know, I don't know what he's talking about. What? He, like he wound up at the wrong mall and found a black Santa. And what did he do? What did black Santa do to you? <laughs> okay, and then, uh, and then he's, when I first heard this, I heard it as audio. And when he went and said, hey, you know, you do need a black Santa, I thought he was talking to a cast member or something that was black. Then I watched the video, dude's totally white. <laughs> so yeah, like that say, and I guess he must have black family members because right. they referenced it. But they're like, here's our black expert, a completely white guy. <laughs> <laughs> that was like the closest they could get to a black person. They're like, oh, Bobby actually knows a black guy. So Bobby, what do you think? <laughs> Some of your okay. best friends are black. Uh, okay, now look, there are annoying uh, parts of cultural appropriation and we've talked about on, at, that on the show, right? There's real cultural appropriation like when Elvis Presley stole all of Chuck Berry's songs. Okay, it's a slight hyperbole, <laughs> but there was a lot of that going on and that was real. And if he, and they did not share the proceeds from the people that they stole from. On the other hand, I think Justin Trudeau dressing up as Aladdin is not cultural appropriation. Okay, it might be goofy, but it ain't cultural appropriation. So there's some real issues there, but they don't talk about that. Then they go back to goofiness, and this is my favorite. Okay, he says Santa is a historical figure. Mm. Okay, <laughs> and he is the you know he's the one of the cornerstones of Western civilization. <laughs> so there actually is a historical figure. His name is Saint Nicholas, and that's what. Coca-Cola drew Santa Claus around. Santa Claus is not real. Coca-Cola drew a big guy in a red suit. In fact, they tried other things first. They're like, they tried a skinny guy. And they're like, people don't like skinny guys. Let's make him fat. Oh, that sells more Coke. Okay, that's the historical figure in reality, the Santa that we all know. But the actual Saint Nicholas that it's based on was an actual saint. You know where he lived? Anatolia. You know where that is? Turkey.
modern day Turkey. It's not Tennessee? No, it's not. <laughs> and uh, and that's him, that's an, him on an actual wall, that's a, a real depiction of him. So uh, he was actually Russian, but lived in uh, in the in the Middle East. And that's why when you see different depictions of him, you're like, well, he, he actually looks pretty dark. Wait till you get a load of the next one, which <laughs> Uh, by the way, yeah, no, there are a lot of actual depictions of Saint Nicholas where he looks flat out black. Okay, and and this is, these are not the only ones I'm uh, the, the ones that we're showing you. You can go Google it yourself, right? He is pretty dark. You know who he kind of looks like as a as a for a shade? Me. <laughs> okay, I'm not black, but I'm from Anatolia. Okay, I'm from modern day Turkey, and he so. <laughs> the idea is like, the cornerstone of Western civilization, okay? We're Turkey. <laughs> right? and, and that is why Santa Claus is brown, bordering on black. And I don't want anybody changing that, okay? I got more, but Rayvana, real quick, we got a minute. <laughs> yeah, I just want to say that if, if, uh, if like, if for pretend. Imaginary Santa Claus is the cornerstone of Western civilization. It deserves to crumble. That's the foundation of your civilization. Yeah. That's a joke. <laughs> also, want to say, Stephen Crowder, you're you're uh, an adult. I think it's time that you learn that Santa's not real. But I can really quickly clue you in on why he went to that co-host to ask him about uh, if he'd ever seen a black Santa. His nickname on the show is Quarter Black. He has a black oh. grandpa and holds up a picture of him to prove that he can say the N word. Oh God, they're disgusting. Okay, back to fun real quick. Uh, he says, why do you need a black Santa Claus? But Steven, why do you need Santa Claus to be white? It never even occurred to him. You wanna drive them crazy? Get a too strong coffee mug on the other side. It says Santa is progressive and Jesus is too. <laughs> well, Jesus and Santa give away things for free. They're socialist borderline communists. Okay, do strongcoffee.com slash TYT. Get it if you're a progressive, get it to drive the conservatives crazy, get it for conservative family members. Have fun and then tell them, you know what, Santa's actually brown. <laughs> all right, all the members, we're gonna see you there. We got more fun stories. Uh, that's tyt.com slash join. We'll see you there in a minute. Thanks for watching The Young Turks, really appreciate it. Another way to show support is through YouTube memberships. You'll get to interact with us more. There's live chat emojis, badges. You've got emojis of me, Anna, John, JR. So those are super fun. But you also get playback of our exclusive member only shows and specials right after they air. So all that, all you gotta do is click that join button right underneath the video. Thank you.